cauliflower potato puree, okay? What I've got in the pan now is I've got some whole butter going. I just dumped some shallots, a little bit of garlic in here. We've got cauliflower just chunked out, raw cauliflower. Right here I have potatoes cut with a little bit of water in there. Cauliflower's got a lot of, a lot of natural liquid in it, so we're gonna steam this in its own liquid. We don't need to add a whole lot of water, but there's still a little bit left in the potatoes. We're gonna kinda just put the cauliflower right inside, the potatoes right inside, just like that. And we're gonna let that kinda cook, just like that. Now what we do with this is kinda let this steam on its own for a while. This can kinda sit there for 15 or 20 minutes is gonna take a little bit of time. Next thing is, we're gonna kinda of get the butter sauce going. This is a melted leek butter sauce. So melted leeks is an idea where we cook them down slowly and we get them to a point where they just kinda of get really nice and tender in your mouth and really kinda of almost disappear. We're gonna kinda of move ahead to cut the salmon a little bit. We're gonna cut this filet right down the middle, just like that. Then we're gonna cut nice little blocks. These are about four ounces that our leek butter is starting to kind of get some color on it. So now we're gonna add just a little cream in here. So now we're gonna salt this just a little bit. I'm gonna take our smoker here. We got some cedar chips that have been soaking in water. All we're gonna do here with the salmon, we're gonna lay it on the rack. And then we have some olive oil and we're just gonna rub the fish with a little bit of olive oil. Right now I'm gonna have Kara start putting the butter in here. You have to kind of stir the butter in. You cannot walk away now. If you put the butter in here and walk away, it's gonna melt into oil and it'll break. We've rubbed the salmon now with a little bit of olive oil. Now we're gonna season it with just a little bit of salt. All right, so we're gonna put the fish in the smoker. Just like that. And now we're gonna turn on the smoker here. There we go. Now in a second you guys should start to see this start to smoke a bit. Once we have that smoke coming up then we know that the internal temperature is kind of where it needs to be to make this work. All right now I can tell our cauliflower is, come, is falling apart now. Now by the way you don't have to add the cream um, seriously, you can do this without it, but it, it, no, it will never get quite as smooth as it gets with the cream. If you don't want to do the cream, you could do a little milk or skim milk. You could do a little yogurt. Okay, so now we're going to just kind of saute this up, just like that. Okay, so we got our butter sauce made. We're getting ready to puree the cauliflower into a really nice puree. All right, we're going to pull, we're going to pull this out. Oh, beautiful. So we're going to take our sauce and we're just going to kind of slather that on there a little bit. We're going to fold in some chives into the puree and we're going to stir this in and we'll do a little swoop. Kind of do something like that. And then we're going to grab just a couple pieces of fish, just like that. A little bit of chive on the plate and that's what we got. Oh, nice smooth sandwich.